This video is purely for entertainment purposes. Nothing here is financial advice. Crypto and meme tokens are highly speculative, extremely risky, and can lead to loss of all funds. Always do your own research and never invest more than you're willing to lose. Solana's meme casino is already overflowing. Too many coins, too many gamblers, too much noise. It feels like arriving late to a party where the drinks are gone and everyone's arguing about who rugged who. BNB though, that's still untamed ground. The kind of place where a dumb idea can actually catch fire. So I'm sitting there, late night staring at my rabbi wallet balance, and I ask myself, why keep feeding random meme coins when I could toss my own cursed creation into the pit? Forget being the audience, I'm grabbing the spotlight. If chaos is the game, then BNB is the stage. For months, I was the fool, dropping BNB into meme coins like quarters into an arcade machine, hoping for a jackpot and usually walking away broke. Every win was tiny, every loss was loud. It felt like gambling against a crowd that already knew the outcome. Then, it clicked. On Solana, everyone's already doing the same tired tricks. But on BNB, the field's wide open. That's when I found Launch on Launch. At first I thought it was just another scammy meme site, but then I saw the options and realized this is where BNB chaos gets real. No coding, no begging some dev in Discord, no overcooked Solana clones. Just connect Rabby, click a few switches, and a token exists. Minting support if you want to play Central Banker. Burning support to watch supply vanish like smoke. Pausing in case you want to slam the brakes mid-rally just to spook everyone. Unlimited supply if you're feeling extra evil. It's the exact kind of playground Solana can't give anymore. Too polished, too crowded, but on BNB, this feels raw, unpredictable, alive. One night I spun up a couple of nonsense tokens for laughs, and it felt insane. Now, I've got a name ready and the troll is coming to life. Starting on launch on launch, the first step is choosing BNB Smart Chain, because that's where the real chaos happens. Once that's locked in, connect your Rabby Wallet, the trusty sidekick for this little ritual. Next, the fun part, the name and the ticker. Name, Baby Troll. Ridiculous. Sticky. Impossible to forget. Ticker Troll. Sharp, loud, and perfect bait for Dejan scrolling telegram. Right after that, there's a setting for custom decimals. Keep it on and max it out at 18. That's the standard for BNB tokens, and it makes the supply look way more serious than it actually is. Now for the heavy hitters, the features that make this platform wild. Minting support. When enabled, only the token owner, that's me, the troll master, can create new coins. Imagine being the central bank of your own meme economy. You hold the printer, everyone else just waits. Burning support. Switch it on, and tokens can literally vanish from circulation. Every burn makes supply tighter, and in degen psychology, that means instant hype. It's deflationary, bro. Pausing support. This one's pure chaos fuel. You can freeze the token contract at any time. Trading halts, everyone panics, and you sit there grinning like the troll you are. Unlimited supply. Pair it with minting if you want to be a true villain. It basically means infinite coins whenever you want. And here's the kicker. Deployment is completely free. No shady launch tax, no hidden fee. Just click deploy token, approve the tiny gas fee in Rabbi, and boom, the contract is live. Copy the address. Check it on BSC scan, and there it is, your cursed newborn. A token born from nothing, costing nothing, now breathing on the BNB chain. Now the troll needs a playground, and that playground is Pancake Swap. Head over there, smash the Earn tab, and slide into Farm and Liquidity. From here, click on Create Pool, and make sure you're picking a V2 pool, the classic arena where all the real BNB degen action happens. Grab the token contract you just deployed from BSC Scan and paste it into Pancake Swap. Like magic, our little troll crawls onto the screen, hungry and ready. Time to set the starting price. That's 80,000 troll per BNB. Sounds ridiculous. And that's exactly the point. For the pool, I drop in 0.125 BNB and pair it with 10,000 troll. A cursed combo, but enough to give this newborn coin its very first heartbeat. Connect Rabby Wallet, and then comes the most ironic part, clicking the Enable Troll button. Yes, we literally have to enable the troll. Approve a tiny gas fee in Rabby, laugh at the absurdity, and then hit Add. Tick that useless checkbox PancakeSwap forces you to tick, and slam Create Pool. 
One last gas fee, and that's it. Our troll officially has its very first liquidity pool. Go to my positions and there it is. The baby troll's first day at school. Awkward and shiny, but alive. Now for the flex. Open up deck screener, paste the token address, and watch it appear on the chart. At this moment, we can finally say it. The troll isn't just an idea anymore, it's live. Barely a heartbeat after the pool goes live. Boom! The first buy hits, just $4 slides into the troll pool. Tiny, yes, but the money printer is officially alive. A few minutes later, a bigger nibble, $17. Then the hits keep coming, minus $6, and another $17. Tiny red cell, ignore it. Confidence is everything. Panic kills memes, but steady hands ride the chaos. God, why is it moving so fast? Another buy lands immediately after. Minutes later, a total of $40 drops in. 30 seconds later, $45 more hits the pool. The momentum is insane. Just 20 seconds later, another double buy. $16 and $13. And holy BNB, it keeps going. Another $40 lands, market cap soaring close to $1,000 in 10 minutes. Unreal. As I watch, an even bigger fish gets caught. $49 and $16 hit the pool. Tiny cells pop up here and there, but they're just background noise. We're still raking profit with every update. Liquidity climbs to $731. I'm proud of my boy, the baby troll. But every roller coaster has a stop. Time to pull the plug. Head to Pancake Swap. Click our token, smash the remove button, set the max amount. Choose your payout, WBNB or plain BNB. I go WBNB. Click enable, approve the tiny gas in Rabby, and boom, $373 drops straight into the wallet. That's basically three times our previous balance in just 10 minutes. Baby Troll just went from zero to legend, and I'm grinning like the proudest Deegan alive. And just like that, Baby Troll is alive on BNB, leaving its tiny chaotic footprint on the blockchain. In a few minutes, a handful of buys turned into hundreds of dollars in liquidity and our troll survived the madness. The chart will settle, hype will fade, but that little token will forever be proof. With a bit of luck, the right chain, and some degenerate energy, even a baby troll can make some noise. I lean back, wallet a little heavier, nerves fried, and smile. Mission accomplished.